Hey guys, welcome to a first little run through of Pokemon Insurgents. Now I just started doing this, so we'll see how this goes. I just figured out how to do this. So we'll see how this works. Oh, that's my own game. I need a different game. There we go. Oh, come on. Don't do this to me. I have to drag and click where I want to record. And yeah. <laughs> that's just how this works. Okay, let's go. Let's see if this is all right first. I want to stop that. <laughs> I'm going to be yelling at this thing. Throughout this whole thing. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Okay. We're good, I think. Stop doing that! Okay, well, anyway, I decided I started wanting to do this, and so I thought, why not? Let's give it a shot. Since apparently there's already a screen capture device on here, so I didn't know that, so... Hang on, I gotta make sure I'm timing this. Okay. Sorry, I just don't want to make this too long or too short. You know. So anyway, let's just go ahead and get right into this. Welcome to Pokemon Insurgents. Current version, six badges, apparently. If there's an updated version, someone let me know. It says that, and I thought it was complete. So, I don't know. Someone let me know if I'm missing something. And, yeah. So, it gives you the option of playing lighter or darker. Basically, it's just like... Do you... It's basically... Do you want it like a normal... Like, without the... Um, mention of death and whatnot. I guess. I don't know that's how I'm putting it, but we're gonna go for the darker just because I feel like you miss out on some of the story or a little bit of it if you do the lighter one because I tried it the first time and it just skips something. So we're just gonna go for the darker. Yes, I'm sure. Torin region. One year ago. Can't hit. Okay. Thank you all for coming. We live in dark times, my friends. A grave loss has recently befallen us all. The Augur was a great man. Not only was he an unmatched trainer, but his heart burned with the desire to protect his people. He was our hero and possibly the best leader the Tauran region has ever known. But. But. As you know, there were other... Ugh, can't talk. As you know, where other regions have evil teams or organizations, it's Pokemon worshipping cults that call the Turin region home. But to these cults, religion is so much more than just believing. They won't rest until the world is remade exactly how they want it to be. For our protection, the Augur defeated and disbanded over half of them. He saved us. Oh, excuse me. A week ago, he went searching for one of the remaining cults. He has not returned. He hasn't been seen since. People of Torin, I, like you, do not believe our Augur was dead. I assure you I will search tirelessly until he is found again. With a heavy heart, I accept the burden of taking his place until he is found. Until the first Augur returns, I shall be the second. I promise you I will use every resource at my disposal to find him. We will stand our ground. We will not let these cultists, these insurgents, split apart our families and destroy the place we call home. Long live the Torin region. And then they cheer. We will remain strong. Okay, yeah. Oh, there's creepy Gengar eyes. <laughs> no, I'm not doing a challenge run. <laughs> if I was doing a challenge run in my other game, then I would have... My Pokemon would all be dead. <laughs> Hello? Is this thing working? Can you hear me? I don't know who's talking to me. <sighs> oh, thank Arceus. You're not gone just yet. You've got to listen to me. It'll return any minute now. Why is my stream getting so dark? <sighs> the brightness is changing. I don't like it. You need to stay focused and remember all you can. If you value your memories at all, you'll listen to what I have to say. I'm listening. We need to be quick. You at least remember your name, right? Okay, I remember my name. Okay, so... My name! For those of you that know, I go by, in my stories at least, I go by Sandra. 
So I know my name on here is Two Spotted Talent, but on my fan fiction, it's Kyrie X Sandra, and so we're just gonna go with Sandra. Easier to say and stuff. I don't know then. Two Spotted Talent, I would think. Okay, we'll do that. Yes. And I am a girl. What do I look like? Oh, which one do we want? See, I have brown hair, but the thing is, I don't have that dark of skin. Oh, uh, but purple hair is nice. We'll do purple hair. We'll give ourselves purple hair. Why not? Who doesn't want purple hair? Ah, Gengar. I didn't read that. I should have woke and read that. Oh, well. It's here, Sandra. You need to wake up. I don't like getting up in the morning, dude. If you're a dude. I don't know who's talking to me. I sent someone to fend it off and get you out of here. You need to wake up. And there's Gengar. Oh, and look, dark Darkrai people. All right, the door is locked and Gengar is doing her thing. Oh, it's a her. Gengar's a her. <laughs> Soon Dream Eater will read, read the prisoner of the last of her memories. Hopefully we'll be done within the hour. Well, how is our youngest prisoner faring? According to the computer, Miss Persephone, their memories should be completely gone very soon. Everything is going as planned. Excellent. Finally, we'll have filled our end of the bargain. Good work, you two. We are starting the ritual soon in the upstairs room. Will you be attending? Of course, miss. I would never miss a sacrifice. Very well. I will see you upstairs then. Miss, wait, I have a question. After the child's memories are gone, what do you plan to do with them? Kill them, of course. See, there's the murdering person. I expect you upstairs within the within two minutes. These guys are like all a bunch of serial killers, I swear. These guys are all just murderers. I mean, come on, this is not nice. I'm an innocent child, what did I do to you? Why are we bothering to wipe their memories if we're going to kill them, just going to kill them anyways? No clue, but thanks for not asking that in front of her. <laughs> You know how she hates to be questioned. Let's go upstairs then. It's always fun to see a ritual being performed. Fun? How is that fun? I don't get this. How is it fun? Gengar, leave me alone. I'm trying to sleep. What was that? Actually, I know what this is. It's a meow. Chase Gengar off. I don't think that would normally happen. The Gengar's gone. Go, follow me and get out of here. And never look back. Good luck. Okay. See, yeah, there's our little character. And we can run already, so... Let's go ahead and look at Mew here. I know we're not keeping it. Because I've played this game. I'm not all the way through it, but it's not blind. I know what I'm doing. Okay. Not bad, Mew. Not bad. Especially for being, you know, our first Pokemon. And we can't open this door yet, I know. There's a potion! It's just like an item hunt in here. That's what this is. It's an item hunt. I know I can't open these doors. Nothing in here. Up the stairs. Let's see what we find. Can't go there yet. What? Oh, he's holding a note. What do you say? I chose Mew to help you out of this mess due to its special ability. I chose Mew to- it repeats. Why? It repeats. Okay. It is able to use transform to change its form and- well, and disguise itself as something else. Really? I didn't know that's what transform did. <sighs> Never seen a ditto before over here. <laughs> However, unlike ditto, Mew can transform you as well. Oh, okay. Here we go. That's good. There's something different. If you can find DNA, you can disguise you as someone else. You should be able to use this to escape the base. Good luck. You're a benefactor. Who in the world is this person? I want to know who this person is. Where am I going? Oh, look at this. Dried up blood. We've got the DNA of a Darkrai cultist. Transform. Darkrai cultist. I'm a Darkrai cultist. Oh my god. We're no longer our cute little girl. We are a dark eye person. Wait, that means I can open these doors now, can't I? I bet I can. Actually, I don't bet I can. I know I can because I played this. Just 
See, uh, items that are useless on Mew, considering it's level 65, but you know, it's whatever. Items, items, need items. Nothing in here, this door is useless. Okay, what's in here? What do I keep? And this was the room we were in. So there we go. We unlocked all these doors and now we can continue on and hopefully get out of here. Actually, we're not going to get out of here quite yet because I know what I'm doing. I know it's more fun if it's blind and I don't know what I'm doing, but I know what I'm doing. So that's what this is. Yes, unlock. I want to get through here. Let's see down here. What is here? Person, shouldn't you be getting ready for the sacrifice along with everyone else? Why? What if I don't want to? What if I just want to leave? Ice heal. Potion. Oh man, it's little. Another awakening. Oh, I thought it was ice heal again. Is it an awakening? My bad. So I'm sorry if you guys get tired of me running around like this, but you're probably gonna have to sit through it because I don't think I have a video editor on, editor on here, but I probably do. So yeah, I don't know, we'll figure it out, hopefully. And so we begin. Miss, please, you can't do this. I don't wanna die. Oh, the poor guy. You got involved in this, dude. You you should have known this was going to happen. You swore when you joined that you would give your life for us. How is this any different? Activate the ritual circle. Darkrai, Lord of Darkness, I call upon you to enter our world. In return, I offer you the soul of this loyal servant to be bound to your world of dark nightmares forever. I almost said darkness. I'm not going to try and say that. Because I don't mess it up. Uh-oh, what's going on? Actually, I know what's going on. And I'm sure you guys do, too. I'm just happy I could actually get this game. Because I I watched it a long time ago. When it just had three badges. And I wanted to play it. So bad. I don't know if that's too loud. That's probably really, really loud. Okay. There we go. Darkrai, the lord of nightmares. You are great, the great balancer of the world. You punish the great and slay the immortal. It has been a year since I last saw you. Since I saw you last. Okay. <sighs> My inner writer's coming out and I'm rewriting things. You remember what occurred then. We accomplished something incredible that day. What'd you do? I thought finally you had accepted our offer to join us. But you fled soon after, never to be seen again. But now I call upon you again. Darkrai, will you, why will you not join me? It hasn't said anything! <laughs> I know my sister has seen you time and time again. Why do you favor her over me? I beseech you, Darkrai, join me. Join the cult that has worshipped you for so long. With my guidance and your power, the world could be ours. And it leaves. It leaves. Rejected. <gasps> well, isn't that just lovely? Uh-oh. <gasps> probably gone off to Celine City to see my sister again. What a waste of a grunt. And what do you two want exactly? I wouldn't be going over to her if I were you. Leave her alone. Miss, please, I'm confident that if we tr had another try, we could trap Dark right here. We don't know if it, why it didn't work this time, but it, if you'll just give us another chance, get out of my way. Fire blast. Oh, evil. See, this is why you don't mess with them when they're mad. I'm going to go check on the prisoner. None of you would better follow me. And I think that's our cue to leave because we are the prisoner and we ain't he there. Because we're the prisoner and <laughs> we're not there. We ain't there no more. We're over here. Get out of my way, dude. Let's get out of here. Before they catch us. Well, I really don't... Well, they might. It's actually kind of 
a sign that's like, we have a Mew behind us. How come no one says something? Okay, and now we made it out. We're in Shade Forest. And I'm sorry if there's no music sometimes, guys, because this seems like there's certain places that does not have any music, and it's weird. I mean, it's just, I don't understand it. But there's no music. And here we go. Oh, Telnor Town. There's a small flute and another note in Mew's hands. We got the quartz flute. Which is awesome because I play flute, so I can play that. <sighs> this flute lets you call upon Mew when needed. To use it, go into your bag and either use it directly or register it. Good luck. Your benefactor. Okay, thank you for. Oh, and Mew's gone. Bye, Mew. And there's a kid here with white hair. No fair, I want white hair. I could swear I saw Mew here just now. Did you see it? A tiny pink Pokemon? It was floating really close to you. Um, no. Oh, I could swear I... My name's Damien. I'm an aspiring Pokemon trainer. And you are? Sandra. Got it. Really. I don't know how you got it so fast because I'm horrible with names, so... You came to Telnor Town at the perfect time. The Augur, the greatest man in the world, of course, is coming today. Oh, Lord. You know who the Augur is, right? Uh, yeah, I know who he is. Of course you do. Who wouldn't? He's only the most amazing person ever. Sure he is. The mayor and the townsfolk have been preparing ever since this morning. I'm excited. I was just running errands before he arrived. I know. Why don't you help out? We're assigning jobs in the town hall. You know, cleaning and so on. Okay. I'll go ahead and go. Why not? Let's see, do I have any? I don't have any Pokemon anymore. I think. Let's go talk to people first. Let's see. Who are you? Pokemart. I got five Pokeballs from this person. I did not know you could do that. I missed out on this last the first time I played this game. Ah. I didn't need to spend money on Pokeballs. What am I doing? <laughs> okay. At least I didn't do it this time. I really need to learn to talk to everybody. Now let's go over here and... Oh, come on, don't freeze on me again. Sometimes it freezes like that and it's just slow sometimes. I don't know why. But it's weird. I finished cleaning up the road. Is there anything else I can do? Oh, this is Sandra. I met them outside. They offered to help. They, I'm a they. <laughs> well, not a they, technically. I'm an it. <laughs> I'm a girl. <laughs> nice to meet you, Sandra. Well, Damien, I think we're pretty well finished. Pretty well finished. I think it's pretty... M I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> as long as you have your gift for the auger ready, I think you're done. You do have your gift, right? Oh. Well, um, no you don't. <laughs> I may have forgotten. Of course you did. You're the... Why? <laughs> of course you have. <laughs> oh. You better find one, and fast. I heard you could find a rare stone in one of the caves in the forest. Of course, you need a Pokemon to go safely. No, absolutely not. Not a chance. <laughs> hmm. Damien is not ready to get a Pokemon. He's still just a child. Children get Pokemon. <laughs> I've seen little kids with Pokemon. Mom, please. Everyone else in the town already got theirs and have left. And you're not going to follow them. You'll just, you'll get yourself killed. Why do you care? It's not like you're my real mother or anything. Oh. Oh, okay. I raised you since birth. You're not capable of raising a plant, let alone a Pokemon. Why am I getting... Sorry, my phone's vibrating. And it's like right under my leg. Why is my brother... What's he sending me? That's cool. I don't know why. He's sending me pictures of shoes. Okay. Anyway, sorry about that. You're irresponsible, antisocial, and you can't even... That's enough out of you two. You're embarrassing us. Yeah, a little bit. A little bit. You said your name was Sandra? See, he remembers names better than I do. I am horrible with names. I'm surprised I remember any na names of the people in my work. 
like the first day, I remembered certain ones. And I'm like, how did I not, how did I remember these? I'm sure you've handled a Pokemon before. We'll lend one to both you and Damien. Would you be willing to help him through the forest, the cave, to, to help him find a gift for the auger? Sure, why not? We're nice. Wonderful, I'm very grateful. We're nice people. So it's settled then. Sandra will help Damien to get a gift for the auger, and if Damien shows responsibility, perhaps he can keep the Pokemon afterwards. Well, how does that sound? Fine. He won't, though. Oh, man. They... Sandra, let's go. Yeah, let's just go. And I'm just crouched and kind of running. I'll meet you in the professor's lab to get an Eevee. She has a bunch of Eevee from her days as a trainer. The lab is just in the southeast corner of the town. I'll see you there. I really hope I don't mess this up. Hey, Sandra, thanks for agreeing to do this with me. It really means a lot. You're welcome, Damien. We're just gonna keep running. Okay, and so he said southeast. So we're going this way. In fact, no, I know where I'm going, so. Should I talk to these people? You know what, I'll talk to them when I've got my Pokemon. And now we slowly head inside with Damien. <laughs> Listen, Professor, these Pokemon, they're freaks. Keep going, come on, keep going. Don't crash on me now. <laughs> no other trainer would want them, and we can't keep them any longer. All I want is for you to take them. You already keep a bunch of Eevee as is. Surely the these three won't be a bother. Why do you care about them? I know what you've done. It's true, I'm merciless. I've done some awful things, but there's no reason for these Pokemon to die. Um, hello? I'm sorry I don't do voices, but I'm not good at voices. I'm Damien, and this is Sandra. We're here to get a Pokemon so we can go into the forest safely. God. Sylvan, if you don't take these Pokemon, I'll release them, and they're sure to die in the wild. If you want, you can just give them to these kids, right? Put them on the table. Very well. Oh no. So there's three Pokemon there. Excuse me, please. Guy that looks like Giovanni. So you two are in need of a Pokemon. Yes, ma'am. I see. That man was that was here that was in here just now. He was one of my colleagues in you in the university. He's a smart man and a great scientist. He's also the leader of the cult of perfection. A cult leader? Those people are evil, Professor. You shouldn't be talking to them, let alone be accepting gifts from them. Tell me, Damien, Sondra, have you ever heard of something called Delta Species? I have, but we're going to say no just so she explains it. Me neither. Then allow me to explain. Delta Pokemon are based on a phenomenon in the Holon region, far away. They're Pokemon... Um, that have different DNA than normal Pokemon. Simply put, they're typed differently than normal. For example, would be an electric type Dragonite or a water type Porygon. These Pokemon are the, on the table now are Deltas. I'm not sure what type they are, but they seem to be experiments of Bulbasaur, Charmander, and Squirtle. They're scientific marvels. I would love to keep one to study. Now, normally I would give you an Eevee as a Pokemon to start off you off on your journey. However, it seems they, there are three more options for you to choose from, so I will offer you this. You may choose one of these three Delta Pokemon to travel with, or the Eevee I normally give away. If you want an Eevee, talk to me. Otherwise, take your pick. Sandra, I don't know what to do. I don't like the idea of Pokemon made by a murderer. But I don't like the idea of these Pokemon left all alone forever. You can pick, but hurry. Hurry up. We don't know when the Augur is arriving. Okay, so then we have the option of an Eevee, which everyone knows. And then there's the fairy and psychic type Delta Bulbasaur, which is kind of cute. <sighs> then there is, if it'll pop up, the ghost and dragon type Pokemon Delta Charmander. And then the dark and fighting type Pokemon Delta Squirrel. So these are our choices. Now, I prefer Charmander, just to say. Because I like it. I don't know why. I've kind of... At first I thought it was kind of creepy. But then it was like... I I used it and it grew on me. It really did. 
And I don't know. I like it. But then I also think Bulbasaur is adorable. The little Bulbasaur. I don't really, I'm not really a fan of Squirtle. I'm not. I don't know why. It's just I don't like the fully evolved Blastoise either. But I don't know. I think I'm probably... Uh, I want to go with Charmander, but at the same time, it's like... Uh, I don't know what to name it. What should I, if I get it, what should I name it? Oh. What time is it? How much time have I been going? Okay, I think... Uh, we're going to go with Charmander. We're going to take it. And let's see, what should we nickname this? Charmander's a boy. Ghost and Dragon. Oh, shoot. I don't know what to name it. What should I name it, guys? Oh, man. I don't know what to name it. It's a Ghost and Dragon. When I think Ghost and Dragon, I hear, like, kind of dark. I don't know. Something dark. But see, the only thing... I kind of want to name it Batman just because I'm really into that, like, that I really love Batman and I've been really into that lately. Oh, should I just name it Batman? What should I name? But it, Batman doesn't make sense for a dragon. Then again, do I really care? <laughs> do I really care <laughs> if it makes sense? <laughs> I mean, it just has to be a name I like. I mean, I might as well just name it Batman. Should I just name it Batman? We're just gonna name it Batman. It's just gonna be named Batman. There we go. Mm, we named it Batman. Sandra, I think you're right. I'm going to pick a Delta Pokemon just like you. Good for you, Damien. Good for you. Now what? Hey, Sandra, before we go out, go out into the Shade Forest, how about a battle? It'll be a perfect time to test her, out our new Pokemon. Let's go. Battle, our first battle against Damien with our new Delta Pokemon. Got Squirtle. And we have our Charmander, Batman. Oh, someone's probably going to yell at me for this. I don't know. I like the name Batman, but if you guys can think of a name, let me know. And like, I'll, if I like it better, I'll change it. And we're just going to keep going for Twister. We're just going to, oh, it knows Pursuit. Oh, God. Ooh. And this is why we go for Twister, because it can make it flinch. And there we go. There we go. We won. Wow, you're a great battler. Do you think maybe you could take on a gym someday? All right, Sandra, here's the deal. I'm going to head north into Shade Forest. At the northern end of the forest is a really large cave, and in the middle of that cave is the rare stone we're looking for. I'll meet you there, okay? Okay. Sandra, can I talk to you for a moment? Sure. Damien rushed off before I could give him one, but I'd like to eat you to have this. We got a Pokedex. Dex. I, I don't know why I just added an ED on the end, but I did. This is the Pokedex, short for Pokemon Index. It is a data collection of all Pokemon that I give to trainers. If you see a Pokemon, it will be registered in the Pokedex. If you catch one, the Pokemon will be full of data regarding that Pokemon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Set to go on your adventure and then head north. Okay. We're going to go north. Why? And our Pokemon follows us. Tell me something. Okay. Well, we're gonna go. We gotta go north now. Let's heal first, because I don't think we're healed. Yeah, we're not healed. We'd be screwed if we went out now. Very, very screwed. So I guess I'm probably gonna end it here, but just to show off a few things to you guys that are new to this game or anything. Obviously, it's a really nice game. Um, up here is the Pokemart where you can buy things. Just like, talk to this person. And right now we don't have that much money, but they, all, they, they do sell Pokeballs, potions, repels, and antidotes so far. That's all they got. But I'm not going to buy anything right now. Just because I think Charmander will be fine, considering probably most of the Pokemon out there have normal type moves. And they don't affect Charmander because it's a ghost type. Well, Batman. 
I need to get used to the nicknames. And down here is a clothes shop. In the basement, a very Pokemon Center, and you can buy different clothes. So there's hats, shirts, pants, hair. I'm not gonna buy anything right now because I wanna save my money. And to be honest, I'm okay with how I look right now. I mean, I would love different stuff, but for now I'm okay. And this guy is the name rater, so he can rate the nicknames or you can change it, you know, whatever. I'm gonna see. You wanna critique my one nickname here? It's a decent nickname. Would you like me to give it a nicer name? No, I like it. I like Batman. And this is the move deleter. Right here, and they're always in the Pokemon Center, so at least I think they're always there. So just come down here if you ever need those two to help you. They will help you out, no problem. And yeah, so that's pretty much it for now, guys, I guess. So let me know what you guys think about this game so far, what you think about me doing a series. To be honest, I think I'm pretty excited about this, because... And I don't know, I just... I've never done this before, and I can do other games because I do have an emulator on here for like, I have Pokemon Dark Rising on there. I have, and um, like some of the series in that, and then like I have like Fire Red and Ruby, and then I also have Pokemon Cloud White, although I don't, you know, I haven't done much. So, you know, let me guys know what you guys think about doing some more Pokemon games series on here, because I really excited about this especially this one because it's such a good game so much fun and I don't know I really like it even though it says it only goes up to six gems but if there's like an update I'm missing just let me know guys please just let me know because I don't know what you know I just don't know <laughs> I don't even know what I'm saying at this point woo okay so anyway guys that's gonna be it for this and episode so make sure you leave a like support this series and hopefully i'll get some more stuff up soon watch me get the next episode up like right after this one because i'm just gonna be like so excited to do this but i can only do it when no one's at the house and i'm the only one at the house with the dogs so yeah that's what i'm doing right now so anyway guys i'm sorry i'm rambling Anyway, I will make sure you leave a comment and a like down below. I really appreciate it and what you guys think. And I will see you guys next time. Peace out.